You're watching Tommy Talk with Molly Smith on Tommy TV. Hi, this is Molly Smith with Tommy Talk on Tommy TV. I'm here with Mrs. Miller, the principal of the junior high school. Why don't you introduce yourself and tell us a little bit about yourself? Well, hello. Um, my name is Jessica Miller, and I am the principal here at TJHS. This is my second year in the district. I started my career in Pena. I taught fourth grade for 10 years before going into technology. I was the technology integration specialist for the Pena School District for the next seven years. And then I became the principal of this building just last year. What big changes have come to the junior high in the past couple of years and how has it improved the life of the students? Well, what I've um, witnessed myself is um, more technology integration uh, throughout last year and even this year. We're very fortunate to have these alternate learning spaces here in the building. So we are presently in the hot spot. We call that the higher order thinking spot. And kids use this location to um, videotape things with the green screen. Uh, it's a collaborative space. We encourage students to use the space with just technology, no pencils or paper. Um, they also are able to 3D print here as well. And we also have TVs here that they can plug in their Chromebooks and use them more for collaborative work. What other type of new opportunities, in, like non-traditional opportunities, do the junior high students get? As far as like technology or, okay, we also have um, STEM classes uh, for our seventh and eighth grade students. Um, we have Project Lead the Way here at school um, where we um, incorporate real world experiences into the science classroom. Uh, so for example, students in our eighth grade STEM class just finished designing toys for uh, children with cerebral palsy. So a real world application of what they're learning in science class. Mm -hmm. What other type of leadership organizations does the junior high provide? Well, we have um, Builders Club, and we also have Student Council. Both groups uh, do a lot for the community and for um, our students here at school. Uh, our Student Council is very active here in the building. Um, they help promote our fundraiser. Uh, they help with a lot of the incentives that we offer to students. Uh, they also are, or they're just very helpful, and they're very active. They make decisions here, too, in the building as far as what they want to spend their money on. I'm very proud of their efforts this year. How do you think the technology and the leadership organizations better prepare the junior high students for high school and life beyond high school? Well, anymore, um, regardless of how you feel about technology, it's everywhere around us. So the more experiences our students have with using it properly and um, just learning how to communicate with it uh, in a real world way, the better prepared they are as they enter the workforce or their careers later on. Okay. What is the biggest priority for the 2019-2020 school year? Hmm, that's a good question. Um, I guess our biggest priority is to make sure our students find success here at the junior high, whether it's through um, athletic activities, extracurriculars, or just things that they do every day in the classroom. That's why we incorporate um, the technology. We give them ways to complete projects, um, just a multiple or a multitude of ways mm -hmm. to find success. What do you think is the best part about working in this building? I have an amazing staff. Um, we are able to provide so many opportunities for kids. Uh, we are able to address the students' needs, and we work together as a team. And I really enjoy the team atmosphere of this building. What do you think in the past school year or the upcoming school year is the most exciting event at the junior high? Well, I don't know if I can name just one. We have so many things that go on here um, for our students. Uh, for example, our music concerts, to our school dances, um, to our incentive parties. We just always have something going on here, and I really hope that our students have a good experience while they're here at TJHS. Thank you so much for speaking with us today. Is there anything else you'd like to add? Go Tornadoes. Go Tornadoes. This was Molly Smith with Tommy Talk on Tommy TV. Thank you for watching.